Ever wondered why a golfer hailed as one of the best in the world barely clinches any major wins? Meet Charlie Hull, a golfing prodigy who stunned the world with her skills from just 11 years old. But despite her undeniable talent, she faces a common challenge in the world of sports, the ability to consistently win. Picture this, March 24, 1996. A tiny village in England welcomes the arrival of a golfing sensation. Charlie Hull was destined to leave an indelible mark on the world of golf. Her journey began at a mere two years old when she first grasped a golf club. Under the guidance of her father at Kettering Golf Club, her love for the sport blossomed. But it wasn't just her father who shaped her path. Her mother, Basena Hull, a former county-level tennis player from Poland, played a crucial role too. Charlie's talent was evident early on. By 11, she achieved the prestigious status of a scratch golfer, a testament to her natural gift and unwavering dedication. At 13, she and her parents made a bold move, embracing homeschooling to allow Charlie more time on the course. Reflecting on her childhood, she admitted homeschooling wasn't always fun. She missed out on school friends and struggled to make new ones, but she understood that greatness often demands sacrifices. As Charlie Starr rose on the amateur circuit, so did her reputation. Climbing to third place in the world amateur golf ranking, she captured hearts and headlines with impressive victories at renowned events like the English Amateur, Welsh Amateur, and the Harder Hall Tournament in the US. Charlie's rapid ascent led to a monumental decision, turning professional at just 16 in 2013. Charlie wasted no time in making her mark in the professional arena. With a string of remarkable performances on the ladies' European tour, including five consecutive second-place finishes, she quickly established herself as one of the brightest talents in the sport. Her achievements didn't go unnoticed. Crowned Rookie of the Year in her debut season, Charlie also received accolades like the Best International Newcomer at the SJA British Sports Awards. But it was her historic debut at the 2013 Solheim Cup that truly solidified Charlie's status as a golfing sensation. She became the youngest player ever selected for the prestigious event and played a pivotal role in Europe's historic victory. Despite initial setbacks, Charlie and her teammates secured Europe's first ever title away from home. Charlie's first professional single victory came swiftly in March 2014 at the Lala Merum Cup in Morocco. Shooting an impressive 62 in the final round, she clinched the win in a playoff. This victory capped off a sensational year for Charlie, who started her professional career at the same event in Morocco the previous year. Despite her successes, Charlie's quest for major glory has been marked by near misses and heartbreaking defeats. Despite coming agonizingly close several times, including three runner-up finishes at prestigious events like the ANA Inspiration, US Women's Open, and the AIG Women's Open, the elusive major title remained just out of reach. But through it all, Charlie's determination never faltered. Charlie's journey reached new heights at the 2016 Rio Olympics, where she proudly represented Team Great Britain in the women's golf competition. This marked the return of golf to the Olympic Games after 112 years, and Charlie was there to represent her country with pride. Though narrowly missing out on a medal, her performance was nothing short of spectacular, showcasing her remarkable talent and unwavering commitment to excellence. She finished with a commendable seventh place. Despite six professional wins and numerous runner-up finishes, there's one childhood dream that continues to elude Charlie, becoming a major champion. The reasons behind her inability to achieve this dream remain a mystery to many, but recent years have shed light on the challenges she's faced. Last year, Charlie shocked the golfing world by revealing her battle with severe attention deficit hyperactivity disorder. Since her diagnosis, she's gained insights into her condition recognizing her triggers and taking time off from the golf course to prioritize her mental health. Charlie admits to struggling mentally, experiencing impatience and boredom during play. However, understanding her diagnosis has brought clarity and improvement. I can understand now why sometimes I get bored on the golf course, she shared. I feel a lot better now. Learning to keep her mind engaged and practicing patience has become paramount. Charlie's journey towards managing her ADHD has just begun but she's already seeing positive results. Charlie's return from her hiatus showcased her resilience and determination. At the U.S. Women's Open held at the iconic Pebble Beach, she secured a second-place finish, matching her best performance in a major event. This remarkable achievement signals a potential turning point as Charlie learns to navigate competitive golf while managing her ADHD. In Charlie's journey, there's another challenge she's faced, a lack of strength in her arms. 
She often experienced her arms shaking during the final rounds of events, which can be disastrous for a top-level player like her. However, Charlie believes a change in her fitness routine could be key to finally winning her first major golf title. Despite being weak in her arms, she humorously mentions not being able to do a press-up. Charlie is among the long hitters on the LPGA Tour, consistently ranking in the top 30 for average driving distance. Charlie, with her unique qualities, has been a top player for years, competing at the highest level. This speaks volumes about the tough competition on the ever-growing LPGA Tour. Interestingly, she's often compared to Lexi Thompson, the American golfer who entered the global stage around the same time as Charlie. Both were young and had a similar age when they rose to prominence. Thompson, like Charlie, is a long hitter and has clinched a major tournament. Charlie, despite being close at times, is still pursuing that major success. However, this year just might be Charlie's breakthrough. Tired of settling for second place, Charlie showed promise in her first appearance of the year at the HGV Tournament of Champions in Orlando. Despite going over par in the first round, she made a spectacular comeback, finishing tied for seventh place with seven under. Charlie seems to be a player who gets better as the year progresses and as she competes in more tournaments. The signs are pointing in the right direction for her. Last year, she made the cut 14 times in 18 LPGA events, finishing in the top 10 five times, including four runner-up positions. Her game is undeniably progressing, leading many to believe that she's not far away from winning her first major. Charlie expressed her excitement ahead of the tournament in Riata, reflecting on a good season and a solid start in Orlando. She believes in her progress and is optimistic about the upcoming challenges. At just 27 years old, Charlie is impossible to ignore, both on and off the course. She's one of the world's most popular players on the tour, currently ranking 8th in the world with nearly $8 million in career earnings. On social media, she's a force to be reckoned with, boasting 380,000 Instagram followers, a testament to her widespread appeal. Only Nelly Korda and Lexi Thompson have more followers than she does. Beyond the golf course, Charlie's personal life has also garnered attention. In 2019, she married English MMA fighter Alex Smith, but the marriage didn't work out, leading to a divorce a few years later. Rumors about her dating life circulated when she posted pictures on Instagram with former soccer player Lee Tomlin. As of now, her love status is unknown, but regardless, we wish her all the best in her personal endeavors. Charlie Hull is not just a remarkable golfer, but a captivating personality both on and off the course. Her journey, filled with challenges and triumphs, continues to unfold, and fans around the world eagerly anticipate what the future holds for this talented athlete. If you want to learn more about the world of golf and the fascinating lives of golf's biggest superstars, be sure to hit subscribe to 4Golf for more content just like this.